When I was a young engineer, I was designing the stair for the Sears Tower renovation. And I designed a structure, it was a pretty good structure, but very ugly. And this architect, Jen Kim, came up to me and he yelled at me. He said, an engineer should always design his a structure that an architect would be ashamed to cover up. And that's been, been kind of a philosophy of our work for some time. And this exhibition is a look at architecture and art through the lens of engineering. We're looking to create new technology that can lead to new architectural design. I think one of the cornerstones of SOM is this strong uh, relationship between engineers and, uh, and the architects. And that's why, like, you know, you see in this room, I mean, all, what you see is all engineering. Typically, you would never see them um, because some, most of the time, these, these things are covered up, uh, either with architectural cladding or just a wall or something like that. So we've put them on display for all the glory because they're actually they're quite beautiful as, uh, as elements. Really, can you tell the difference between engineering and the architecture? The lines are really blurred, even though we're displaying structural systems here. And it's actually a benefit to our engineers that they're able to distill very complex ideas down into very simple things that people can understand. Yeah, the hand drawings are very important because you want to remind people that these things are done by people. So it's not the art itself, but the engineering behind it. Often people don't realize how engineering can be this uh, dynamic and uh, exciting. Again, if someone went to see the artwork, they probably would overlook that it was engineered. And I guess that's the point, because all we're doing is helping to enhance the artwork. That idea of the, the hand drawing carries itself through the art of engineering and the things that SOM contributed to the art, artist's work. The room we're in now, we're called Engineering Times Arts. And, and, and we've taken some, some of the artists we've collaborated with in the past and talked about some of the technical issues that relate to their installations. We go back to the Picasso. Uh, we talk about uh, some of our collaboration with James Terrell, with Jamie Carpenter, with Janet Eckelman. It's very, very important that architects and artists work together. And that's kind of the theme that we have here in, in Chicago this year for the biennial. What we're trying to do is elevate the profession. And so the biennial gives us your, this opportunity to kind of distill all the stuff you're doing into the essence and then present it to your profession.